If you skip, you win. <laughs> if you skip, you're a winner. You're a winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> oh, Daddy! Oh Hello, my Mr. goodness! Goodyear. Hello, Mr. Holmes. Well, Caitlin? <laughs> Your costume! <laughs> oh, don't you like it? Oh, I do! <laughs> Caitlin, come on. Show some respect for your father. Show some respect for me, child. Lies. Build a character. Alright, let's see. Uh, anything here. On her face. Uh -huh. There's a necklace here. I don't know. No, I didn't mean to skip. Fuck. No. No, I fuck. I fucked up. I skipped. Uh, I skipped. No, I didn't mean to. Alice is Sherlock Holmes' new neighbor. She is young and beautiful, and she seems to relate well to children, but she's still not married. The love token that she wears alludes to her connection with the with a criminal world, she suffered a difficult past. The scars indicate she survived a suicide attempt. Judging by her jewelry, she's interested in okay science. Okay. You know, Father, Miss Alice was telling me all about her travels. She has already toured the world with her own father. Your daughter is exquisite. And just to think that she was aboard the Orient Express when it was attacked. <gasps> what a, what dream. a dream! Indeed. She's so creative and imaginative. And that reminds me, would you allow Caitlin to visit me, so that she can practice playing the piano? Uh. Preposterous of instruments, I hate the piano. I'd rather her not. Why did you say that? Caitlin, we are neighbors. We'll meet again. Until then, I shall leave you with this book. Thank you, Miss Alice. I was been like, just fucking go. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> but no. No. Do I have to dress up again? <laughs> Ten of War the day after the finale. I think I'm good. I'm all right, you want me to go bald, Jesse? I'll go bald. We shall go bald for the rest of this case. Uh, let's see, what kind of suit do I want, though? Hmm. I'll just go with the casual suit. And then we'll go bald. Hire. Bop, 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 bop. I've lost my hair. Is there? There we go. Completely bald. With glasses. Let's look at the. Yes. I look. <laughs> uh. Oh, yes. I look like a villain. <laughs> I look like a villain. I am a villain. We are going to be a villain. Huzzah. You are a bald villain. Huzzah. <laughs> Everyone's gonna be like, why did you shave your head, Sherlock? <laughs> That's what I wanted to do after I won. Shave my head. Grow a mustache and a beard. That is why I did it. Papa. A statue did it. It killed Zacharias. Calm yourself now, Sir Charles. You've had a shock. A statue. Let the police do their duty. What can a mere inspector like you do about it? You don't know anything. A mere inspector? Sure. And now here comes Mr. Holmes. The Hello. Are you here to receive a prize as well? <laughs> Very amusing, Holmes. <laughs> it looks so you can weird. go home. <laughs> the ceremony's been cancelled. We've got a murder scene here. Really? And to think, I only came here for my prize. I know, Holmes. I saw your name on the list of finalists. 
So go away. You're not going to congratulate me. What? Do you really think I'm that naive? You turning up out of the blue and then bam, a murder? There's a surprise. Oh, you're making a spectacle of yourself, Lestrade. Let's just pretend that I'm a simple mm. consultant, your humble assistant. Oh, all right then. A club member, Mr. Zacharias Greystoke, was killed at around four in the morning. There. Now, don't mess around. I promise that I won't, Inspector. I will be good. I'll be a good boy. What do you make of the facts? It's quite clear. The murderer intended to steal the Mayan calendar. He was caught by Zacharias Greystoke. He then took up the first weapon that came to hand, the statue spear, and killed Greystoke. Then he fled, just as Sir Charles was coming out of the club. Unfortunately, we've been unable to find any trail beyond the club's wall. It's as if the murderer vanished into thin air. Take a look for yourself. All right, let's go look around. Investigate the scene of the crime. A piece of the statue's mounting rod. Anything interesting here? Oh, some Traces scrapes. Of metal on stone. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, God. This spear came from the statue on the pedestal. Yeah, I remember that. Okay. Money was left inside the wallet. Okay, so they weren't after the money. Could say that for sure. Dry leaves. They make a noise. Zacharias probably walked across them. Okay. The case is scratched and dented. Can I see what time it was? The case is scratched and dented. There we go. Tissot so watch. Swiss. 1855. This watch is valuable and old. It's been through a great deal. <laughs> Zacharias's folder with some documents. These drawings represent the Mayan symbols. All valuables were left on the victim. The strike was powerful and well aimed. Okay. If I believed Lestrade, this Mayan calendar was the reason behind the murder. Can I help you, Mr. Holmes? Can I help you, Mr. Holmes? No, oh, no. You're good, my dear boy. Let's see, anything here? Sir Charles, are you able to tell me in detail what happened? Ah, Mr. Holmes. Well, to prepare for the awards ceremony, I decided to spend the night here at the club. I was sitting alone at my desk when I suddenly heard a loud, metallic sound and a terrible shout. I hurried outside and, and well, I found the body of Zacharias. And I swear it, I saw the statue of Tekun Uman running away. Sir Charles, where did the Mayan calendar come from? It was donated anonymously. We received it shortly before the tournament, with a letter asking that it be awarded to the winner. You saw the statue running? It, it was dark, but yes, I'm sure of it. It was running, and it was making the most horrible metal sound as it did so. And can't you see? The pedestal is now empty. Is the calendar valuable? Uh, not really. It has historical value, of course. But to be truthful with you, Mr. Holmes, it isn't worth very much. Hmm. Did you know the victim? Yes, of course. It was Zacharias Greystoke. He is, well, was a club member and an excellent bowler. But why was he here so early in the morning? Oh, I don't know. May I go in the clubhouse? It's members only. 
I cannot authorize anyone unless that person has a written warrant from the police. Okay. Okay. Precious stone, poor quality. Okay. Then. Ex military, okay. Ring married. Ah, okay. Well, how do I do it again? A murder at my club. What a disaster. Man. I don't know. Alright, well, I fucked that up. I don't fuck the game. So I can't go up there. Uh huh. A broken branch. Somebody jumped into the tree and then over the wall. A broken branch. Somebody jumped into the tree and then over the wall. At your service, Mr. Holmes. Okay. Oh, there's something right here. Scratches on the stone. At your service, Mr. Holmes. Did you search the clubhouse? What for? The murder took place outside. Can I help you, Mr. Holmes? Hmm. If I believe Lestrade, this mine. This spear came from the statue on the pedestal. Oh, 
A broken branch. Somebody jumped into the tree and then over the wall. Only club members have access. Murder at my club. What a disaster for our reputation. What a disaster. What a disaster. Trace it. You're still here. What? Interrogate whistles. I did. I interrogated everybody. Can I? There's nobody else. I believe Lestrade, this mind calendar was the reason behind the murder. Hmm. I'm missing something. You're still here. I'm still here. Can I help you, Mr. Holmes? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me the secrets. At your service, Mr. Holmes. have his membership card on him. Money was left inside the... Hmm. Dry leaves. They make a noise. Zacharias probably walked across them. Dry leaves. They make a noise. Zacharias pro uh, let me see. I think I did, but let me I'll check. Let me check. Oh, uh, you're right, Shell Sprout! You are right. Wait, wait. Hey, stop it. Stop it. The statue ow! of no, ow, ow. Here we go. This one. Here Traces of metal on stone. Traces of metal on stone. The surface is damaged. Yes. The iron mounting rod is broken. It looks like yeah. the statue broke away from its pedestal. Okay. Cool. And, uh, I think we got it. We got a cook. And what about the statue? I've no idea yet. I imagine the thief must have taken it somehow. Hmm. That's a right. big, so heavy thieves, statue. They were very well equipped. Yes, must have been. But then there's also Sir Charles's version, but uh... please go on. <laughs> he said this morning that he was alone at his desk when he heard a shout. He went outside and saw Greystoke lying on the ground, and believe it or not, he said that there was no one else on the green that night but the statue itself running away. <laughs> you mean that the statue might have killed the victim? Interesting. 
Absurd, more like. Someone Besides, like took the place foggy. of the statue, so I guess. Somewhat like your version, then. Imagination talent helps you to visualize objects. So he moves one, two, and then three. Four. Actually, be a wasn't like that. There we go, I think I got it that time. Maybe. It looks as if Zacharias was killed the moment he approached the calendar, and killed by the spear from Takunuman's statue that jumped from its stand and escaped over the wall. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, to well say it, bro. Your conclusions as my consultant? My conclusions are approximate to Sir Charles's testimony. <laughs> oh dear, you think the statue did it? Everything points to the fact that the spear was thrown from the pedestal and Mr. Greystoke appeared not to notice the killer. <laughs> Indeed. The journalists will be ecstatic about your version. <laughs> I would like to examine the victim and take a look at his belongings. Oh, you've amused me at least, Mr. Holmes. Very well. I'll grant you authorization for the examination at Scotland Yard, but nothing more. All right. Yay! Hello. Scotland Yard to the Scotland Yard. Ho ho! The statue did it. Shell Sprout, the statue. The statue. Thank you for coming so quickly, Watson. Lestrade already has the victim's body in the autopsy room. I'm always ready to help any time, Holmes. I'm always ready to help, Holmes. Uh, okay. You haven't made a good action yet. Shut up. All right. I'm always ready to help any time, Holmes. Calm down. Look at all these criminals. Can I help you, Mr. Holmes? No. They're useless to me. Ooh. Oh my goodness, evidence. Tissot watch, Swiss, 1855. This spear came from the statue on the pedestal. This is the evidence we found so far. 
Oh, Zacharias had already translated some symbols. Money was left inside the wallet. And uh, yeah. An ordinary pencil. An ordinary pencil. Oh, crazy. Crazy. I'm always ready to help anytime, Holmes. He's always ready to help, guys. Always. Always. Uh, morgue, I guess. To the morgue! Lovely. Lovely. Lovely time. It's a lovely, lovely time. Alright, let us, uh... Oh, lovely. It was a powerful throw. The spear pierced right through the body. The coroner mentions in his report some specific cardiac and digestive system damage. Hmm. Traces of alcohol were found in the stomach. Apparently, Zacharias had been drinking before his he death. He was drinking before his death. How dare you? This is where the spear entered the body. The murderer aimed for the heart. The weapon must have been thrown by a strong and skilled person. Yeah, for sure. These scars are old. Eye. It looks like a serious infection. Hmm. I'm always ready to help anytime, Holmes. You're useless, Watson. You're useless. Useless to me. Anything else we all right for them? all we need to really look at. Alright. Alright. Let's see if I can... I have any clues to put together. There's no need to disturb the Strahd for the time being. Okay, well then, that's all I need. Okay. I'm missing something. Oh, actually, I should, uh... Check one more thing. See if anything else? I'm just making sure like nothing pops up with the like secret looky looky. I don't see anything. All right, all right. Watson, you're useless again. Useless, useless, Watson, useless. All right. This was. else in here? I don't think so. Can I help you, Mr. Holmes? I don't think so. Mr. Holmes? Mr. Holmes? Uh... All right. 
uh, let's see. I did examine the stuff. I don't know why it says, like, I haven't. Like, I literally have done it. I think I missed something. Alright, uh... Not the one I need. That's not the one I need. Not the one I need. That's not the one I need. That's I need to examine like that. I wish it wouldn't mm. That's not the one I... That's... That's not... History? Aha, there we go. Uh, Maya Empire centered in tropical lowlands. The region nowadays known as Jamalia had... Guatemala had reached the peak of its power and influence around the 16th century AD. The Maya excelled at agriculture, pottery, Writing, held their creation, mathematics, leaving behind them an astonishing record of architecture and symbolic artwork. The principal nation of pre-conquest Guacamala was the Quichadors, also known as Maya. Yeah, the name of these people means many trees taken from the forest highlands which they inhabited. Was the he uh, the statue was the last ruler and the Quichua king who fought with his army against the Spanish conquerors in the Battle of Pinel. Where his chest was fatally pierced, interesting, by the sword of Don Pedro de Bla. According to the legend, even the death took a woman can need to protect his people. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Cool. Alright, well, we did that. Useless. So. I guess we need to go back to a place. Scotland Yards. Because we missed something. It's bullshit. I kind of wish it would, like, say, like, in the corner, like, hey, this is how many things you should be finding here. So I don't have to constantly go back. But that's me. Alright. Hi, Watson. The Mayan calendar. Here's a chance to have a closer look. Okay, of course. All right, so let's rotate it. There we go. Interesting. What are the symbols here? I'll need to redraw them. All right. I could use this dictionary to translate the calendar's glyphs. They are the symbols that were drawn on the Mayan calendar. The All papers right. from Zacharias's folder. They can help us to translate the Mayan message. Cool. So. Uh, 
Oh, I see. Nope. We'll change that in a second. Let's start with this. Which looks like... Interesting drawing. Aha. Two. I saw it. There it is. There it is. Very interesting. Curse to be nobody. At least it puts the other words there, so that helps. Because I know, like, this can change. First. We will figure this out one way or another. That's not it, I guess.
I'm just trying to guess right now. I'm just like, might as well, because I know it has something to do with the statue. A statue. And one more word. Which is, where's my fishy? Uh, there it is. Curse to appear anyone to disturb sacred temple or home or village to meet fate, to meet death, sealed statue, only chosen. I don't know. You guys think this is it? I have no fucking clue. <laughs> Weak to uh, curse to appear. Anyone to disturb. Like, the problem is there's just too many fucking options. I don't fucking know. Cursed to appear. Cursed to be nobody to disturb. Sacred village. <laughs> Fly. To first to exist. Nobody to disturb sacred temple to meet fate. To meet death sealed. I don't know. I'm get, I'm getting like it all. I don't know. To be. I don't know, I'm just gonna go with it. No, I think I've missed something here. You think I missed something, you fucker. <laughs> Curse to be no by to disturb sacred temple. I don't think so. I should pay more attention to details. Your detail. What is the details? I don't like there's literally like we have to pick words. That's it. Weak to appear. No 
nobody. Too disturbed. I don't think so. I should pay All right, more we're gonna to skip because I can't. I no, I'm not wasting my time on this. Cursed yep. will be anyone who disturbs the sacred temple. They will meet their death by the risen statue. Only the chosen will have mercy. Well, I was kind of close. A it's a curse. Not Zacharias really. Zacharias Greystoke, a member of the club, was killed as the curse decreed. It's possible that the link between Zacharias and the curse is at the archaeological club. I'll need a search warrant. Search warrant. Alright, let's look at the, this. Uh, 